Tino Knatterdin. I was born in Amsterdam in 1961 and I live in New York. My name is Ines van Lamsveren. I was born in Amsterdam in 1963 and I live in New York now. The idea for this exhibition was, um, has started seven years ago when we um, started thinking about making a book of all our work and um, about how to make it exciting for us to work on that book and on the show that would go um, eventually with that book or pre-publishing um, of the book. So we, we decided to actually um, not go for a chronological order and to kind of create um, a sentence in which all the pictures are the words and like a perpetual sentence that keeps going and going. So this exhibition and the book that's coming out in a year is, is created, as, created as such as there's no chronological order. All the images are paired two by two. All the pictures are constantly related to each other. Even by um, room in the museum, there is a relationship, but it's a very associative one. It's really purely based on how these images have always existed in our head, how they live together in our head and in our life. The show starts, um, you know, with, our, in our mind, our most important work um, that sort of sums up um, our way of working with digital manipulation and using um, computer manipulation um, to sort of show an internal experience on the surface and um, this work is right behind us here. It has, uh, it's called Me Kissing for Nude Passionately. It's from 1999. Um, there's a counter work to it, um, a much smaller print, uh, deliberately of me and Vinod kissing. Um, it's called Me, and Vin me Kissing for Nude Lovingly. Um, that's hanging right there in the beginning of the show as well. And the show ends with um, the third image in this series um, that was made for, um, L'Envin Homme, in which um, we shot each other uh, together um, in um, an, a, a similar kiss, but by which um, my body was painted all red as if the skin has been torn off uh, my body, where Vinod is sort of literally under my skin. We've always deliberately tried to be in between every different genre of work um, that we're moving in, in between art, fashion, portraiture. To be always of, on the edge of yeah. everything and, be, and staying mm -hmm. independent. And trying to sort of make those lines blur um, by adding, I think, an emotional value to everything, uh, every piece that we're making. I think the big thing that's a given in our work is that there's always um, something that shows in the eyes of the person that we're photographing um, which in our minds makes it the images transcend into any field and make them become images of human beings rather than oh this is a fashion image this is a portrait and this is an, an autonomic art piece um, all our work deals with humanity, with humankind. Um, we feel a, a fashion picture is a portrait in itself, always. Um, a portrait picture, the moment you credit the clothes underneath it on the page, becomes a fashion image really easily that way. Um, so already, it's just depending on the context um, in which an image appears, and we like playing with that. Quite a few um, sculptographs, as we call them, um, uh, that we make together um, with my uncle Eugène van Lamsweerde, who is a sculptor. He's 85 years old. He lives outside of Paris. And um, about seven, seven years, years ago, we started working together. Yeah, we started, we found each other both at, the, as a, at a point where we were um, frustrated with our own field because and needed a, a way out. Working the computers for like over 20 years, we 
had the need, we always start thinking in layers and we had like, how can we add the third layer that is tridimensional? And then we came to her uncle and he had the same problem. He said, how can I integrate photos to my work? Yeah, and human, uh, and, um, human uh, figure. show a human, human figure in my abstract sculpture. Yeah, the other com uh, collaboration that we are um, um, uh, showing parts of here is um, our long, long collaboration with MM Paris. They're graphic designers, um, uh, art directors in Paris who um, we've been working with for about 15, years, 15 or? years or something like that. And we do a lot of our fashion campaigns with them. Um, we used to do a lot for Yoshi Yamamoto and Balanchaga together. Um, and they have designed um, the maze-like structure of this show and um, the wonderful catalog slash newspaper um, that's been printed specifically for this, for which we chose one iconic image per year uh, over, over the 25 years of our career. And um, uh, the, the projects that we've been doing with them, um, like we're making an alphabet together um, by which they use um, our images to turn them into fonts. Um, the latest edition um, that's also on show here in, in the shape of posters is also in that newspaper um, which are the punctuation marks based on our celebrity portraits. And um, uh, they're longtime friends and we each inspire each other, irritate each other, uh, make each other grow and, and it's a wonderful collaboration.